Hey guys, in today's video lesson, you're going to practice your listening comprehension and learn some English by watching a widely popular UK soap called EastEnders. Let's roll. What? Well, it's nice to see you too. Yeah, well, I could do without you summoning me by text. I loved what he said there. I could do without you summoning me by text. To do without someone or something means to manage without that person or that object. I could do without you summoning me. To summon, to summon someone means to ask for that person. You can tell that this gentleman is miffed. He is a little annoyed. Okay, had dad having a massive go at me about seeing Lola. Dad had a massive go at me to have a go at someone. Pay attention to the preposition there. To have a massive go at someone means to start fighting with someone. It's very commonly used. Lola? Yeah, we're back together. Huh. Well, I wonder how long it'll last this time. Anyway, where's dad? Well, at home, I guess. That's where we left him. Right, well, Scarlet's is locked up. So? So, it's lunchtime. Dad would never close Scarlet's at lunchtime. Well, don't look at me. Well, don't look at me. That's what he says. It means I'm not responsible for that. What a great phrase to learn here. So the expression is don't, don't look at me. Well, don't look at me. I'm not responsible for that. He's got no right telling me who I can and can't see. I'm not a kid anymore. Okay, he has no right telling me who I can or can't see. The phrase that I want you to learn is to have no right and then you must use the ing form, the gerund. He has no right telling me who I can or can't see. Anyways, you can check out EastEnders, practice your listening comprehension and learn a lot of useful everyday words and phrases. See you soon.